I don't think there's ever been a better time to understand cultures and have tolerance for them. Definitely. You know, because of the, the, the power of what YouTube has or, or an audio um, a podcast platform has. You can reach anyone from, you know, anywhere in the world. Definitely. And they'll have opinion about your culture based on what you'll show them. 100%. Um, so super interconnected more than more than ever before. Definitely. I mean, I used to tell people if you have a public account on social media, you are just an unofficial ambassador of Saudi Arabia because people are interested mm. in it. And, uh, you know, unfortunately, you're the only kind of people into it because, you know, it, it's been so closed off. And now that it's opened, you know, there is that interest. Yeah. It's very enigmatic, you know, as a country. There's, you know, a lot of rumors that circulated, uh, you know, Lawrence of Arabia kind of stuff. And mm. now it's like, but then we have Neom, you know, and now we have Alola and, and all of these things that are so, I mean, you know, I always tell people, it's not Saudi's time to catch up. It's Saudi's time to lead. Mm -hmm. And we will, because we have that support from the government. We have that support from even, you know, just friends and, and family. Like, you know, everyone wants to do something and we're, Hungry. Super excited. Exactly. Hungry We're for hungry it. There's for an it. Exactly. appetite for it. You know, when I was a kid, I remember I was at the American school here, and so most of the kids were foreigners, and, you know, there was always, like, some type of teasing about Saudi, and I was always that kid, like, well, then, you know, if you don't like it, leave, you know, yeah. kind of like, you know, third grade, like, getting all angry, <laughs> and now it's so funny, because now I feel like this is finally where I get to show people why I'm so obsessed with Saudi, yeah. you know, I was able to do things here that I couldn't do abroad, you know, when I first moved back here, you know, I got this job, this amazing job at Arab News, where if I was anywhere else, I'd be serving coffee for a good year, you know, before I got that chance to write a front page story. And I that? got that, you know, that How opportunity. about that? That's crazy. 